guys, my name is Alex Chacon, and one thing I've learned about traveling to over 70 countries is that language is the hardest part about traveling. So today, I'm in Mumbai, and I've enlisted the local help of Indian celebrity, Barka Singh, to help me learn Hindi and teach you guys the Hindi phrases that you're gonna need to know if you visit India. Are you ready? I am ready. Chalo! Chalo, let's go. Hindi is the fourth most spoken language in the world that is mostly spoken in the northern territories of India, including Mumbai. English is widely spoken, but generally the people you'll be conversing with most are statistically less educated in English, like a rickshaw driver, food, and street vendors. So the following basic Hindi will be incredibly useful. First up, directions. And rickshaws are the most common type of transportation you'll take in India. So another really important thing in a city is to get from point A to point B. When you get into a rickshaw, you're gonna tell the guy where you wanna go. So you will say Bandra Chaloge. Will you go to Andheri? Andheri Chaloge. Rickshaw etiquette dictates you must first ask the driver if he can take you to a certain area in town. Uh, Bandra Chaloge. If you're visiting a major tourist spot, the driver will most likely know it when you say it. If not, you'll have to ask Bandra Chaloge, meaning the neighborhood of Bandra, can you go? And from there, it's easy to guide him manually to where exactly you want to go. Right is Bhaiya Dainelo. Go left is Bhaiya Bainelo. Stop is bhaiya ruko and go straight is bhaiya seedhe chalo. Left, right, straight and stop are the keywords to use. The best trick is just to show them your phone with Google Maps already open and tell them you will guide them there by shouting where to turn and stop. Bye Lena, bye, bye seedhe chalo. Ruko, ruko, ruko. Next is commerce. Asking how much a service or tangible item costs is the most common thing to ask when traveling. How much? Kitne ka? Kitna, how much, can be used in asking the price of a rickshaw, food, tourist ticket, and more. Kitna? Uh, yes, he said I look good. Acha. Acha hai. I feel like I should go climb Mount Everest with these. Numbers. One, eight. Two, do. Three, teen. Four, char. Five, panch. Twenty is base. Thirty is thies. Charlie's is 40 and 50 is Pachas. The most important numbers to know are 1 to 10 and multiples of 10, all the way to 100, as they are the most common denominations you'll be dealing with. Yes, Hanji, no is nahi and thank you is shukriya. No, I don't want. Nahi bhaiya, nahi chahiye. Okay, it's TK. And if you want to add the Indian flair, you gotta do the Indian nod. Yes, Hanji, no, nahi, okay, TK, thank you, shukriya, no, I don't want, nahi chahiye are great tools to use as people will constantly be asking you to buy something, be asking you where you're from, and will certainly ask to take a selfie with you. Uh, can I take a picture? For extended language and some fun, you can flip the tables by being the first to ask to take a selfie with a local by saying Taswir Le Saktahu. Taswir Le Saktahu? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Finally, it's guaranteed you'll have to seek out a bathroom at some point. So to ask where it is, just use the English word washroom. The English word works almost every time. So where's washroom? Washroom kaha hai? Where's the station? Station kaha hai? Washroom? You just have to do this. Really. For extra fun, you can use the pinky symbol shown. It really does work. All right, that was for Survival Hindi with Barker and I. So thanks for joining us and... Again, people here are so friendly and wonderful. I love India. Okay. Hello? I'm trying to pick a sunglasses to buy, but they're all so ugly. I don't want to. Dai Lena Bhaiya. Bhaiya. Say it again. Bhaiya. Bhai Lena Bhaiya. 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 Yeah. So when something really disastrous and you say, what the heck, in India, if you do this sign, it's like saying, what the heck, man? What the heck, Barka? What the heck? What'd you throw at me? 